Welcome to Millionaire Coins Today's video, we'll explore the fascinating history, rarity, value, and auction prices of the 1990 USA 5 cents coin, also known as the Jefferson Nickel. Stay tuned to find out if this common-looking coin could make you a millionaire. Let's start with the historical background. The Jefferson Nickel, first introduced in 1938, replaced the Buffalo Nickel and has been in circulation for over 80 years. The design features the famous third president of the United States, Thomas Jefferson, on the obverse, and his Virginia home, Monticello, on the reverse. Asterisk images of Thomas Jefferson and Monticello appear on the screen. In 1990, the U.S. Mint produced nickels at two facilities, Philadelphia, with no mint mark, and Denver, marked with a D. The Philadelphia Mint produced around 658 million nickels, while the Denver Mint produced about 641 million. Asterisk display the production numbers on screen. Asterisk, Philadelphia Mint, no mint mark. 658,839,000 coins, Denver Mint, D, 641,618,000 coins, with hundreds of millions of these coins produced, what makes the 1990 Jefferson Nickel so special. Like many coins, the true value lies in its condition, rarity, and any potential mint errors. Asterisk cut to close-ups of error coins, such as misstrikes and off-center minting, one of the main factors that can drive up the value of a 1990 nickel is if it has any rare minting errors. Some of the most sought-after errors include off-center strikes, double die obverse, and die cracks. These mistakes occur during the minting process, and when collectors discover them, the value can skyrocket. Show a chart with examples of error coins and their potential values. Although not all 1990 nickels are rare, those in exceptional mint state condition, particularly with errors, can fetch a high price at auction. Let's talk value. In general circulation, the 1990 nickel is worth face value, just 5 cents. However, the condition of the coin plays a huge role in determining its worth. A coin in uncirculated or near-perfect condition, graded by professional services like PCGS or NGC, can be worth significantly more. Asterisk show graded 1990 nickels in plastic cases with high MS, mint state, grades, like MS65 and above, nickels graded MS65 or higher have been known to sell for $20 to $100 or more. However, the real jackpot comes when you find a flawless 1990 Jefferson nickel with an MS67 or MS68 grade. These can be valued at several thousand dollars, depending on demand. Asterisk cut to footage of auction houses and online bidding platforms. In fact, some 1990 nickels have sold for impressive prices at auction due to their rarity in high grades. But here's where things get really interesting, recent auction results. In the last few years, collectors have paid significant amounts for pristine examples of the 1990 nickel. A rare, mint state 1990 D. Jefferson Nickel in MS68 condition sold for over $5,000 at auction. Asterisk show the auction result on the screen with details of the coin. These high prices are driven by the rarity of finding a nickel from 1990 in such exceptional condition. Remember, the majority of these coins have been in circulation for over three decades, so most of them show signs of wear. Asterisk cut to clips of circulated coins with scratches and dull surfaces. Could your 1990 nickel be worth millions? While it's unlikely that a typical 1990 nickel will fetch millions, high grade, rare error coins can still be worth a fortune. It's important to get your coins graded by a professional service if you think you've got something special. Asterisk cut to a professional grading service evaluating a coin, who knows, your 1990 nickel could be a hidden treasure waiting to be discovered. Wondering how to check if your 1990 nickel is worth more than just pocket change. Here's what to look for, asterisk text on screen with bullet points asterisk, condition, look for coins with no signs of wear, sharp details and a shiny surface, mint marks, check for a deep mint mark from Denver or no mint mark from Philadelphia, errors, look for misstrikes, double dies, or other unusual characteristics, grade. Consider getting your coin professionally graded if it appears to be in near-perfect condition. Always examine your coins carefully, and don't hesitate to consult a professional if you believe you found a rare specimen. To wrap up, 
while most 1990 nickels in circulation are worth their face value, there's always the chance that a rare, high-grade coin could be worth hundreds, or even thousands, of dollars. If you're lucky enough to find one in mint condition or with a rare error, you might just strike gold. Asterisk footage of a happy collector holding a valuable nickel.